I'm going to show you how you can create a group policy central store to manage all of your AMDX files across an Active Directory domain. So to start, I'm logged on to my primary domain controller and I'm going to go to group policy management and then edit any of the group policies. So I'm just going to right click the default domain policy and press edit. And then under policies, if we expand it, we should be able to see where our policy is getting the AMDX files from. So it says administrative templates, policy definitions, AMDX files retrieved from the local computer. So if we just close that, by default, the local computer is C windows and then a folder called policy definitions. And in here is all of the AMDX files. Now the problem with managing it this way is that all of your domain controllers can technically be out of sync and all have different policy definition folders. So to create a central store to have a centrally managed location, if you copy the policy definitions folder and then open up a run box and then browse to your local Active Directory domain and press OK and then go to Sysvol, your local domain and then policies and then in here paste in that policy definitions folder with all of the AMDX files. So now if I just minimize these and then edit this um, edit this group policy again, when we go back to policies and then administrative templates, we can see now it's been retrieved from the central store. So now anytime someone opens a group policy management for this domain, it will pull the policy definitions from this centralized spot and they will all be in sync. So whenever we need to add any more AMDX files for upcoming Windows versions or Office versions, we can just paste them in here and then all group policy management clients will get the, those AMDX files and they will appear within here. So that's how to create a central store for your group policy management.